Hey everyone, here we are post-match with CJ Wood, senior CJ Wood from Garden Valley and freshman Massimo Ivorone. Uh, guys, let's talk about that wild match that just happened. Um, you know, CJ, I'll start with your senior night. What were the emotions going through your head uh, prior to going out there tonight? Yeah, definitely. It was a uh, great environment. We got some of the student body to come out. Um, so definitely um, very, very hype environment. Yeah. Um, again, Strathaven, you know, great team over there. Um, and it was for the uh, Central League Championship pretty much. So a great environment. Uh, glad to, glad that it was on senior night and we had a lot of uh, people show out. All right, so let's talk about the crowd for a second. Uh, what did you think of the recreations of some of those uh, falls that you guys had? They were funny, for yeah, sure. Yeah, do you want to give a shout out to anyone that, that was in the crowd yeah, for Yeah, shout out uh, Reed Farrell and Zach Libertor with the pins. That, was, right. that was super funny. Yeah, you know, and Mike with the guy in the background. Uh, and tell me a little bit about about the guy to your left there, about Massimo. Uh, first varsity match, gets put into a pressure situation where he's got to go out and perform. Uh, and, you know, you, to tell us, talk us through the, the roller coaster that was that match. Yeah, so super proud of this kid. He works very hard in the room, you know. First varsity match, he went out there. I told him before the match, you know, just keep the calms in, or keep the nerves in check, you know. Obviously, a big environment. Freshman, he's going to have some uh, nerves out there. Told him to keep it in check, you know, wrestle his match, wrestle for six minutes. He did exactly that, stayed off his back, um, saved the team some points, and then got the team points. So it was awesome, awesome to see. Super proud of him. Yeah, huge, huge turning point, Moss. Uh, talk to us about, you know, talk to him, tell us about the beginning before you went out. What were you thinking? Did, did you know you were going to be in the lineup tonight? Uh, this afternoon, I found out. Uh, I didn't expect it. Uh, I was very nervous going into it. Uh, uh, Coach Fantasi hit you with that this afternoon? Uh, you, Right before practice, yeah. Okay. I mean, right before the match. Okay. All right, for the match, they let you know. So then, uh, you know, you're warming up and you're getting ready to go out and step foot on the mat. Like, what are, what's what's going through your mind? Uh, I'm just hoping not to get pit, and that's my only goal. Uh, of course, I want to score points, but I, I didn't expect something like that to happen. All right, so, you know, in the third period, you get back to your feet. You're down, I believe it was 7-1. Uh, did they did they instruct from the from the side to, to go hit the headlock or is that just out I of? I threw it. I, I heard no no no. But then once I once I brought him down, I was like yeah yeah yeah. And I was just I was just praying you would stay there. Yeah. So uh, and again, you know, what did it feel like when you hear the slap of that mat and, and people going nuts? It, it was amazing. I, I can't describe it. it is it CJ? Is it safe to say like he's like reaching legendary status with this oh, win? Yeah, definitely. It's, it reminds me of the Flicker match from two years ago uh, against Westchester Henderson. It was awesome. Yes. Yeah, so, uh, guys, really appreciate taking some time after the match tonight. Uh, you guys wrestled well, and you got you know uh, Quaker Town in, yep. the, in the quarterfinals on uh, Friday night. Good luck there. Good luck. You know, you. trying to punch your ticket to states, guys. Thank you. Thank Take you. care. Appreciate Good luck. You. Thank you. Whenever you're ready. Okay, here we are uh, after the match with head coach Rocco Fantasi from Garnet Valley. Coach, uh, before we talk about the match, uh, tell me a little bit about this group of seniors. I think it was 11 seniors you honored before the match? Yeah, I mean, to me, this is, uh, you know, to get 11 seniors and, you know, when they're freshmen and all 11 kind of stay with it um, is something special. Uh, and also, these guys have, like, have proven themselves to be competitors and to be be winners. Like they came in when we first won our, our first centrally, or you know, our first run at the centrally title. This is, I guess, maybe fifth in a row if we get through these next two weeks. But um, you know, these guys came in. They they kind of came when they, we started the new culture and the tradition, and they did nothing but help us win that first year, and they did nothing but continue that for for the last four years. They've been doing nothing but competing. Uh, they like these challenges. They like these big situations, these high profile matches, and they and they find a way to do the job and win. So um, you know, it's a special group when you get a group that's that competitive, that knows how to win, um, and they're a tight knit group. I mean, I've never had so many seniors that have a nickname, like everyone on the team came in with a nickname and, and they that's how they identify themselves, you know, so it's it's awesome. Yeah, they, uh, you know, it seems like Riki and, and Wood and Hussein just been around for just so long uh, and like, you see your point, they just, they, they've just been contributing forever. Mm -hmm. um, and they looked like, they just looked like they'd been there before. They, they had just this calming presence uh, uh, that, about them as they approached tonight uh, out there. Uh, and uh, that was pretty neat to see. It was just the conscious things like, you know, Strathaven uh, uh, adversely is kind of on the way up a little bit. And, you know, they're learning how to get in these situations. Mm -hmm. And uh, this was a, definitely a, 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 something that will help them in the future. Um, let's talk about the match. Uh, obviously some swings. When did you know Massimo was going to be uh, inserted in the lineup tonight? Well, I mean, that was like game time decision. It was depending on who they put out there. And, um, 
you know, when we saw that they put out, you know, who we wanted on there, we, we told Moss, it's your turn, go do it, have fun, you know, go out there and just 110%, you know, our philosophy tonight was, uh, you know, you get on the mat, you put your foot on the gas, and you keep your foot on the gas all six minutes. And we just ask you control your your, your hustle and your effort, and be and you know out tough them. And the way, ever the way the match falls, I'm satisfied. You're satisfied, and I guarantee you we'll come on top. So you know, from us, it was it was a game time decision. We were we were prepared for him, and once we got the matchup we wanted, and we knew it was it was his turn to go out. So and you know, he he was a little unsure in the beginning, but you saw his confidence start to grow, start to grow. And he, and he let it fly, and that's that's all we can ask. So now, did you uh, did you see that the Trollio pan over Crawford come in? Um, you know, they would wrestled probably some tight matches in the past. Uh, you know, I mean, you know, Sammy Sammy is capable of pinning anytime, any place. Uh, it's you know, Sammy. We, we want to see him. You know, put more of of uh, you know that that attack mentality. But Sammy has in his mind what he wants to do, and when he's ready to explode, when he's ready to attack, he's capable of doing it anytime. So you know, it's it's. Once again, with his experience, he's been to the next level. He knows when he has to go and, and go for that fall and take that fall. And, 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 you know, our mindset as a team, we know and, and we preached it, you know, don't be satisfied with the decision. We need you to get those bonus points, you know, and, and that's what we shoot for. So, we, you know, you're winning, go for that fall. Yeah. So. so let's turn the page. Let's look ahead. Friday, mm -hmm. Laker Town. Uh, you're back to the drawing board trying to, you know, uh, probably looking to probably create some matchups. Uh, how do you like your chances this weekend? Uh, of uh, you know, find your way in that top four. I mean, it's going to be tough. I mean, we, you know, we. You know, we, we, we are who we are. You know, I don't have the team that we did two years ago where we could come in and we can mess around the lineup. So, you know, we're locked in at a lot of matches, but, uh, you know, we're going to go in with, with what we, you know, we control, we can control, and we use what we can use. So we're going to go in and, and use our experience, use our confidence through this weekend, and, uh, you know, we're going to let it fly. And, and we have, you know, at least two opportunities to get to that, that placement match. And, and once again, our seniors can dictate you know what they did in the past and, and and hopefully you know they can they can continue you know where they left off two years ago pre-covid so so well i want to wish you nothing but the best of luck this well, weekend i i appreciate you guys coming down it's uh, awesome um uh, we're, we, we try to create a fun environment so you know hopefully it was a fun match to watch and any uh, students in that student section you want to give a shout out to cj gate a shout out to a few guys uh, no i mean they're called jag nation and uh you know to get jag nation out and to promote it and to get them to enjoy it you know and I told my team I said listen a lot of times reasons people don't want to come out to matches because they don't know what wrestling they don't know the rules of wrestling so maybe just explain what a takedown is or at least just tell me up to every time yeah. so just that little bit they were able to have something to cheer for and maybe you know it'll it'll build the sport of wrestling which is important to do you know because no definitely we, we highlighted it as well because it was great to see it was great atmosphere tonight awesome you know, night. so thanks thanks appreciate for it out. and appreciate uh, good it. luck thank you All right.